hi um guys hi guys um uh i have nothing to say today um so make another what's really hood um i don't know why because well actually there is a reason i'm getting a haircut hello this head of hair um it's head filled with these gorgeous luscious locks I mean, there. I love long hair. I, no doubt about it. I love my long hair, but although it looks, it looks like it's absolutely flowy and like, oh, I want her hair. No, you don't want my hair. You know why? Let me show you why. I wish you guys can see. I have split ends. All of every single strand of hair is a split end, even this side. So, I need to cut it. That means I need to cut it. Like, I don't care if I took so long just to get this much hair. Um, my hair grows actually quite fast. Oh, look at me. I look like an Asian, whatever, my bob. Um, so, yeah, I'm getting a haircut tomorrow. Um, I'm gonna, I, I found a picture, an image that I'm gonna give to the freaking hairdresser and totally just cut my hair i want it kind of this short though like i had it in eighth grade because i remember i cut my hair in eighth grade before graduation and it kind of grew out into this mess so i kind of decided i want to cut it again but not the same exact look because i don't think i have the magazine that i got the look from so probably i won't ever use that look ever again um but i might have to cut it i might want to cut it like that much that short like it, it's gonna be layers again because I like layered hair I have very thick hair and sometimes I'm gonna work with thin hair so I'm gonna cut it up like pretty much want to cut off like this much be like hold on, can you see this yeah I want like that much cut off seriously it's annoying and I want my bangs up to about half my ear so at least I can put it pretty much underneath I mean over my ear because let me tell you something that helps and I don't like if my bangs were up to like if it well I guess it could cover my eye but you know don't make me look emo stereotypical mm -mm. Mm -mm. so I've been oh I made a vlog that I didn't post up yet um it's like three parts and uh made it for my supposed to be for my ipod channel but i'm kind of scared to put it up because it has my mom in it and it has a friend in it and her friend doesn't know i was recording and the only person that knew was my mom and uh, i think she accepts the fact that i record i'm a youtuber now which is awesome i don't know about my dad but i don't think i record when my dad's around it's kind of weird but um yeah, only my brother and my mom know that I do YouTube, and Ashley, and my subscriber, which, forgot her name, forgot her name, um, just gonna give her a shout out, but, um, forgot her username, um, so, yeah, uh, that's about it, cause she's the only subscriber that I actually don't know, but, um, Someday I'll meet you, and if I get more subscribers, I'll meet. I'll have like a meetup when I'm grown up and old and not as pretty. So, yeah. What have I been up to? Uh, ooh, I gotta tell my story about the dream I had, cause it was really weird, it was super duper weird. Excuse me. Um, so 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 so. Uh, I had a dream. I can't even talk. I can't even talk. For reals. I can't even talk. Okay. So my dream was it was really random. It was so weird. Okay. The first thing I see, like, my mom, she wants yeah, I bit myself. She wanted like we I was I don't know on my wake uh on my wake. Um I can talk. So my mom and I just finished work and we like we just leave because we're done cleaning and stuff like we finished washing dishes take out the trash clean the floors 
and we're about to leave and uh we somehow end up in downtown which is so weird that is so random like what like when was the last time I went to downtown um oh right on saturday right um but then it was, it was kind of weird because uh, she said, hey, I'm going to go shopping with my friend that I actually recorded in my iPod video and um, never put that video up. I mean, three videos up because it was a three part video. Um, anyway, so they went out. They went to play, like hang out and like shop and stuff because they needed to buy food, groceries because they're like grocery lovers. Um, and then so I kind of walked around downtown and somehow I saw my cousin and her BFF recording a video. That made me jealous. I swear. That made me pissed. I was like, what? Who? When? Why? Why? Okay. Um, because YouTube is my thing. She's into dancing. My cousin is so used to, like, dancing and, and hanging out with her friends. Not recording YouTube videos and dancing like I Justine. I was so pissed. So I just, I just ignored them. They're like, hi, Tracy. I'm like, ugh, walk away. And then on my way back, I see Ashley. I see Ashley and her cousin. Ashley and her cousin. Yes, her cousin was there. And I was like, oh, hi, Ashley. And she was wearing a Giants hat and a Giants sweater. Probably she just came back from a Giants game. It's totally, like, weird. That was kind of weird because I'm used to Ashley. Like, she's like, oh, let's go to Giants game because she likes Giants. Woo. SF Giants. And so I walk away from that. Because she says, oh, I gotta go somewhere. I'm like, Giants game. So she's like, yep. Uh, it's, this is just a dream, don't worry. And then I go, she's like, hey, you should try out this yogurt place. I'm like, okay. And it's not really a yogurt place. It's like a mixture. It was like a weird mixture of, um, of a yogurt place with a restaurant, a Mexican restaurant. I was so weirded out by that. I was, I was like, what? It's like, why would she go here? It's like, whatever. And then, in my dream, you know, I kind of was still obs like not obsessed with Diego Manetta, but like, I'm on the edge of kind of over getting over him. But he popped up in my dream. Like, what is he doing in my dream? And he's like. He thought it was cute? I don't know. I don't know. It was so weird. It was like the weirdest dream. And then I kind of tried to avoid him because he was so into me. That's not what I want in life. That's kind of pathetic. It's so cheesy. It's like he's so into me and I'm like trying to run away from him. He works there. He worked at the restaurant. I was like, what? How did he become an actor into some guy working at a Mexican restaurant? I'm like, what? I mean, that would make sense. He is Mexican, so that does make sense. Um, but it was so weird. He just, like, talked to me, and he, like, liked the way I walked and stuff, and he just got into me. He was just into me. So he had to go somewhere, and I just, like, ran to the bathroom. I ran, ran, ran to the bathroom as quickly as I can so I can avoid him. Next thing I know... I'm like, I come out of the bathroom, and uh, he is talking the phone. Well, actually, he was calling me. I didn't realize my phone was vibrating, ringing, what? I don't know. I think he was calling, like, someone else. I don't know. I know he was trying to look for me, though. I know he was. It's like, oh my god, I need to find that girl. Where's that girl? She's so pretty. Um, and then... And then, since he was so into me, I hugged him. And I said, I'm sorry for running away. And then we ate together, and that was the end of the story. That was pretty much it. It was like, was like, wait, I ate lunch before, but then I was still hungry. So I pretty much ate with him, and that was the end of the freaking thing. And actually, I missed the part. Like, my favorite part of the whole thing. Because this is so me. This is like typical Tracy action. He was like, hey, you want to eat with me? And I'm like, oh no, my mom won't let me eat with guys. <laughs> so stupid. That's so stupid. Who would say that? Who the hell would say that? Like, no. 
It's like, who says, I'm, my parents won't let me eat with you because you're a guy and, and you're cute and, like, I'm scared we'll date. So, I think, like, yeah, after the eating thing, the eating we did, he was like, oh, come on, we'll eat together and, like, we'll talk and hang out with my friends. I was like, okay, whatever, whatever. And so I looked at the time, it was like 2.02 .02 and I actually had my phone with me. It's like my phone, my cell phone, um, it's not with me right now, but uh, actually it was, it actually popped up in the dream and it looked exactly the same, I had the same wallpaper, I had the same text and font and I was like, what the hell? So I said 2.02 .02 Friday, Friday, why did it say Friday? That was so weird. See, that dream was just too weird. Okay, so I had my cousin vlogging like how I would vlog and I wish I had a friend with me to vlog which would be Ashley but she it's summer it's summer's almost over but you know wish I vlogged with her oh that's what I'll do yeah I'm gonna be vlogging every day at school maybe depends it's not gonna be every day it's gonna be like those important days maybe i'll record something like at school like what happened and stuff like <gasps> someone got asked out and someone like got in a fight or something or someone had a rap battle it's like i wish i recorded everything so yeah that's my weird dream uh kind of getting over diego bonetta kind of getting over that now because it's like old it's been a while like them since July, like in the end of July, like mid-July towards the end. And then I'm starting to see it kind of fades, like a summer fling that kind of fades away. And it's like, get over him, get over him, just like, go. Plus, he's like six years older than me, that's gross. That's gross. That is disgusting. Not as disgusting as Hugh Hefner with his former ex-fiance that was ugly that was just pure ugly okay i'm just rambling right now that's what my what's really hood stuff really is and it's kind of early for what's another what's really hood so that's that talked about my haircut yes i'm getting a haircut tomorrow and yes i have an image to show the hairdresser that i'm going to tomorrow and i really can't wait but i wish i could dye my hair red but I don't think that'll flatter me much. They don't make me look fat. <laughs> That's so weird. I don't care if I look fat. I look good. No, but my brother hates me. Um. So anyway, talked about my haircut. Uh, I talked about my dream, which was so weird. Oh my god, it's been twelve minutes since I've been rambling about a freaking dream with Diego Bonetta in it. That's so awesome, Tracy. Wow. Okay, so I'm gonna go because I keep rambling and I need to stop rambling. Oh, and a shout out to that one subscriber that I actually don't know. She's from Brooklyn and I read your file. I'm not a stalker. I want to know all my subscribers, okay? If I have, a sub if I have subscribers, I want to know them because if I don't know you guys. Seriously, I don't know what I would do in life because thanks to my subscribers, which is like two or a couple, just a couple subscribers, I still love you guys and I do this for you and I do this to make you guys entertained and sometimes you can't see videos from your like favorite YouTubers and they're kind of busy with other projects and stuff. I'm not one of those YouTubers and I want to make sure that you guys have something to listen to and you know, it's not afraid to, you don't be afraid to open up to YouTube world because YouTube is not that intimidating. So after making this video, I feel like it's no longer intimidating. Okay, so I'm going to go. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys later. Holly Love Smooches, like, comment, subscribe. Bye.